Let's talk about function versus classes in JavaScript. Technically speaking, you can use a class to mimic the behavior of a function. You can use a function to mimic what a class does. Both are function. A class will be used mostly when you really want to dive into uh, object-oriented programming in JavaScript per se, like dealing with things like inheritance and 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 so on and so forth. Function gives you a greater APRs to build your your application, right? But as I mentioned before, both are functions. How can I show that? How can I prove you that? So if, for example, we have a function user and a class, let me add a class here, courses, both, if you check their type of, you're going to see that the type of user is function and the type of courses is also a function, right? So they both have the same type. Although courses is a class, it's using the, the, the class keyword. They're both functions, right? But there is they have there is a fundamental difference between a, a class and a function. So let me show you. For example, here I'm going to create a constant an instance of user. So let's say new user here, right? And I'm going to create an instance of the course. Okay. So the fundamental difference here is the fact that if, for example, I change user, I remove it from here, and then I put it right below, you see, my code is still working pretty well. I can access my user here and I see that user is an instance of user, the, the, the function user, right? However, uh, if I do this and I put it right here, you can see that we have an error right away. And the error is basically saying you cannot access courses before its initialization. What does that mean? It means that here, function is hosted, right? So let me put it here. So functions are hosted. That's what it means. And classes aren't hosted. That's what it means, right? So that's one of the fundamental difference between a class and a function. Hope you enjoyed this video. See you on the next one.